Hello, Colas. Welcome back to Viva Basta. And welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on the latest developing stories. We start with Ivan Fresneda of Real Valladolid, as it has been reported that the young right back is really attracted by Barca as he is willing to wait for the club. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking on this other transfer news claiming that Barca have been offered a chance recently to sign this 20 million euro rated Bayern Munich midfielder Marcel Sabitza. We are also going to be discussing on that report. So guys, as we get right into the full stories, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. In spite of finances proving to be a wrench in the works, the Barcelona hierarchy has not abandoned its transfer targets, aiming to bolster Xavi's arsenal before the commencement of next season. Previously, it was said that Real Valladolid's bright young star, Ivan Fresneda, was a target for FC Barcelona, who wished to beef up their right-back position specifically. After Jules Conde's desire of playing more frequently in the centre-back position, and the lack of natural right backs available in the squad, Fresneda has been looked at as a solid low cost opportunity in the market. Now, according to Gabriel Sanz of Mundo Deportivo, Fresneda is also attracted by the possibility of joining Barcelona and wants to wait for the La Liga champions to make an approach. However, the report argues that the young prospect is not willing to bide his time forever understanding there is interest from other clubs as well, including the likes of Juventus, AC Milan and Inter Milan. One of Real Valladolid's exciting talents, Fresneda, is establishing himself to become a fullback specialized for the sole purpose of becoming a nightmare for wingers. The most impressive aspect of his game is his defending in 1v1 situations, where he emerges triumphant on many occasions due to its usage of perfect body orientation to prevent the opposing winger from running into spaces available to him. Following Real Valladolid's relegation from La Liga, the 18-year-old release clause, which was originally worth 40 million euros, has now been reduced to just 20 million euros. As per the report though, Barcelona may be able to sign the young star for just 15 million euros. Reports from Barca on the right back are overwhelmingly good, which strengthens the prospect of acquiring the player. Even so, before any concrete offers can be put on the table, Barcelona will have to get rid of their dead wood. Barcelona have been offered a lucrative sum for Franquicia, and if, man if they manage to sell him before Fresneda starts closing in other clubs, the Catalans will have a fair shot of obtaining the Valladolid man's signature. Of course, going for a new right back has been one of the priorities you know, for Barca. Even though for Xavi Hernandez, he sees it as a necessity, not a top priority, for which I would say it's wrong. We need a right back no matter what. We can't say because we have not strengthened the midfield, we shouldn't go for a right back. What sense does that make? I think a right back is, um, should be a compulsory signing for us. Of course, we don't have any real strong right back that we can rely on. Jules Koundé played majority of the season last time out in that position. And it is no news that Koundé has made it clear that he does not feel comfortable playing at right back. He wants Xavi to keep playing him at his natural position, which is the center back role. And they should not, so I don't think strengthening only the midfield as the whole of this summer so far, we are, here, we are getting transfers only for midfielders. Like, how many midfielders does Xavi want to add to this team? Or is it because he was a former midfielder that he thinks it's all about midfield? I think the right back is very important and it should be prioritized very well. Fresneda has been one of the players that have been spoken about a lot this summer window as Barca have been showing interest in the 18-year-old. Even though there have been some doubts, some reports claiming that Xavi does not still feel convinced by this 18-year-old player, 
especially in top competitions next season like Champions League football. He doesn't have trust in this young star. But from the look of things, it, Deco, the new sporting director, and the Barca board are really pushing for the signature of Ivan Fresneda. He has been showing a lot of prospects this past season under now relegated Real Valladolid. The player, according to this new report, is really happy about those links. And they are saying that the player is eagerly waiting that Barca should make a move for him as he is prepared to wait all the time. He is prepared to wait as far as Barca is still showing interest in him. Of course, we know that talking about right back, Barca's top choice is still Manchester City right back, Jao Cancelo. We know that for Jao Cancelo, it is quite tricky and complicated because Jao Cancelo has some issues with Pep Guardiola and Manchester City reportedly want to offload Cancelo for good. They don't want any other loan move after a very disappointing loan move to Bayern Munich last time out. So now it's all about Barca trying to convince Man City and the player to understand their situation and to accept a loan move, which I think it is quite complicated. Arsenal are also showing interest strongly for Jao Cancelo and as it stands, the player might be moving to Arsenal. So let's see if things can change, but Xavi wants Cancelo because even Fresneda for Javi is still a little bit immature. So let's see what happens when it comes to strengthening the right back position. Then moving on to the next story of discussion. Even though Barca have brought in Ilkay Gondogan to reinforce interior midfield position, manager Xavi Hernandez is said to be on the lookout for another player who could possibly arrive at a low cost and provide goals and creativity from the center. As such, Sport is now reporting that Barca have been offered a chance to sign this Bayern Munich outcast Marcel Sabitza in the summer. Sabitza signed for Bayern in 2021 from RB Leipzig in a deal worth 15 million euros. However, the Austrian international failed to take off at the Allianz Arena and quickly fell down the pecking order. Having hardly played regularly, Sabitza joined Manchester United on loan in January earlier this year. And even though there were some positive glimpses of his ability, Sabitza was held back by injuries. As such, he is now back at Bayern, who have no need for him, even though United are understood to be negotiating a potential permanent transfer. For the Austrian, his entourage has offered his services to Barca. Sabitza is a versatile operator who can play on multitude of positions in midfield and attack. However, given Barca's current situation, their priority is likely to be a direct replacement for departed captain Sergio Busquets. And the 29-year-old Sabitza is not particularly well-versed in acting as a pivot. So even though Xavi is said to be considering the possibility of signing another attacking midfielder, such as Giovanni Lo Celso, that position is not even a priority. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.